Hi everyone. In today's video, we are going to solve this question. The question is sine to the power 4x divided by 2 plus cosine to the power 4x divided by 3 is equal to 1 or 5. But before starting the solution, like the video and if you are new on my channel, please subscribe it. Let's begin to solve the question. We know that cosine square x is equal to 1 minus sine square x. Take the square on both sides. We get this. The left hand side is equal to cosine to the power 4x is equal to 1 plus sine to the power 4x minus 2 sine square x. So we substitute this value in this question and we get sine to the power 4x divided by 2 plus 1 plus sine to the power 4x minus 2 sine square x divided by 3 is equal to 1 over 5. The LCM of 2, 3 and 5 is 30. So we multiply both sides by 30 and we get here 15 sine to the power 4x plus 10 into 1 plus sine to the power 4x minus 2 sine square x is equal to 6. Next, 15 sine to the power 4x plus 10 plus 10 sine to the power 4x minus 20 sine square x is equal to 6. Now, 15 plus 10 is 25, 20, 25 sine to the power 4x minus 20 sine square x plus 10 minus 6 so this is 4 is equal to 0 we can write this is 5 sine square x minus 2 whole square is equal to 0 if 5 sine square x minus 2 whole square is equal to 0 then we can write 5 sine square x minus 2 is equal to 0 and 5 sine square x is equal to 2 and sine square x is equal to 2 by 5. If sine square x is equal to 2 by 5 then we can write cos square x is equal to 1 minus 2 by 5 and cos square x is equal to 3 by 5. Sine square x is equal to 2 by 5 and cosine square x is equal to 3 by 5. So tangent square x is equal to 2 by 3 and then tangent x is equal to plus minus square root of 2 by 3 and x is equal to n pi plus minus square root of 2 by 3 where n belongs to the set of integers and this is the required solution to this question like the video share with your friends and don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel thank you